Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and this is the legendary Iron Man uh, Lone Wolf run where we are trying to beat the game on the highest difficulty with only one soldier per mission. Sounds crazy. I might agree. It, it might not have been the uh, most clever idea that I've ever come up with. It certainly has been the most masochistic one. So we're looking at uh, the end of the month, beginning of February. It is pretty much one year. And boy, oh boy. We gotta step up our game, that's for sure. Do we want to build a psionic lab? Yes or no? Creating psi operatives can be a very tempting proposition because we can we can level them up and they would essentially help us without even going on to missions. So yeah, that might be a good idea. But then again, we're short on, does it cost Alarium? Yeah, 20. We're short on Alarium crystals and let's do a couple of things first. So we can reduce the avatar project further as always but we can't counter the attack which means we gotta fight the chosen this time so first things first we gotta upgrade our weapons because hogbite our templar will not be in the fight uh, i don't know i don't know if i want to sell that because hogbite will not be in the fight we need to make sure that at least the other weapons are fully upgraded. Gotta buy some Melarium. And the superior repeater here is too good to pass. There would be some more chosen information. I think you might want to get that as well. Ah. Now we gotta research the data pad because we're getting low on intel. But what I wanted to do is, what can I do for you, Commander? besides spending most of my intel, what I wanted to do is upgrade the weapons. So here we go. Cannon is upgraded. Um... I think we still need the highest level weapon, but for now, the arc blade might be good enough. It gives the ranger's uh, blade storm a little bit more oomph. Okay. The rest pretty much stays as is. And like I said, we need to make sure that that we can survive the attack, which means for Roby, he very much has the best weapons that we could give him, so I'm pleased. And Scythe will be our second, um, our second soldier on this mission instead of a scope. We just bought the superior repeater. I want her to be able to, not only now, but also in the future, to have a chance to take out really strong enemies with her needle ability. Gives her the chance to take one single shot, uh, and that might be deadly, 15% of the time. If you just do it often enough, um, you can kill even the alien rulers. So beam cannon cannons are that that is a good breakthrough definitely going to do it will help will help um our reaper to deal more damage there's a new mission neutralize the target we can do that and there's a shortage of enemies here which tells me it's most likely that the Chosen will be on this mission. Priest 
Heavy Mag, Elite Trooper, Archon, Elite Proof, Purifier. You know, we can't keep the corpses in this mission, but we would get 270 supplies. Might as well do that. Good. Sky go, uh, goes in. I wish we could keep the corpses because there was an Archon, I think, on this mission. And the whole thing could have helped us to finally get his corpse. Okay, here we go. We are alone on this mission. I was hoping we might get we might get a support here. So we're most likely not going to rescue this guy. Maybe blow up the corner there and then get him out. But I find that unlikely. Moving up here. Let's just ignore these clowns. We don't need to kill them. And if they move away, even better. We had nine enemies, so three packs on this very mission. Okay, so obviously there is another pack here. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're going to be discovered once once we'll go next to him. If we were to knock him down, can we get out of here in one turn? Hmm. I don't know. I think it's too dangerous. Not worth the risk. It's just a little bit of intel. And these guys make short pro uh, process with us if we fail. Yeah, not the most flashy play, I get it. At the same time, gotta make sure that you're not taking too, uh, too many risks. The error for more, uh, the margin for error in this run is so incredibly slim. I'm just taking whatever win I can get at this point. And we've made it so far, I wouldn't have even dreamed about going in one one year so it would be a shame to lose an established resource like think about it that way um, the reaper is currently worth at least 100 110 intel um, because that's what a kernel usually costs um, in the black market you can't even get them at the black market so you you need to invest time uh, to recruit a new hero class on top of it, 40 intel for the superior repeater. Um, 
and yeah, some ability points which we have already put into her. So probably not worth giving all of that up for like what the chance for 50 fucking into. Yeah. More supplies. I really want to get a facility lead for Western United States. Of course, we're getting wounded. That stinks. Four days only? That's great. That's really good. We brought it down from 15 days. Uh, wait one second. How long? Lightly wounded six days. Okay, so it means we can basically put both of them here on the infiltrate the stronghold sort of deal. By the way, I'm not sure if I wouldn't want to get rid of Praetor Mox at the end of the month. We can now use him here. But I want to probably get rid of him because he's a squaddy and if we get rid of him, there's a chance to rehire him at a colonel rank. And I think that's vastly superior. Okay, let's heal Hogbite. So we're going to increase his healing rate. Shit, we just lost the data pad. That's not good. Our defense metrics is manned, that's important. I got the feeling that we're soon going to be ambushed. Nice, okay. Okay, next up, reduce the Avatar project, and here is exactly why Sergeant is such an important rank. Look at that. I mentioned earlier how Dr. Anoxus just came into the um, kind of realm of being able to run these missions by himself, which is great, because now we can put in here, um, get the mobility reward for our Templar, and basically negate the capturing. So this one here is good, eight more days. It's running good. It's running very well. And we can even squeeze in another mission before the month ends. Probably need some more intel soon. And we just lost our data pad, which is lamentable. Unfortunate. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough. That helps our um, play with the Reaper. Gotta go with the Berserk or Autopsy. I think that is not only the Overdrive Serum, but it will also help us to gain the highest tier of melee attack weapons. Strategic resource located. 
a good chunk of um, of supplies. We're continuing to gain intel now. I think we need to build this one up again. I suppose since that worked, we might as well keep it up, Commander. Nice. Okay, so the question now is yeah, we're probably going to do that for the health. Yeah, whenever it says increase combat intelligence, it feels we can't do that with our hero classes, probably because their skill points depend so much on the combat intelligence. Oh my god. Ooh, I haven't even seen that. Remove one block of the avatar progress at the end of every month. Sign me up. Like, right now. That is going to be so important. We're not getting it for the next month. But this is essentially the jackpot. It'll help us to stay in the game. Hell yeah! I haven't even seen that uh, at first. Oh my gosh, how great! That's the best! Seriously! It's such a good reward. It is such a good reward. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Okay. Neutralize field commander, interesting. We got a lot of Lancer, heavy make, shield bearer, Andromedon. And we will, will, and we will be able to see all enemy movement. Well, that is not bad. What's the reward again? Two hundred something supplies. Okay. See, I think we're using this one here to do a little school jacking. Just some mining. So it's not going to, we're not trying to win the mission, we're just trying to get a facility lead out of it. And there we go. Oh nice, we even got some help here. Well, we can see the entire map, by the way, this here is due to a nice little side trip that we got. Now that we know, they are there. Got it. Moving. Might as well take the good old double moves. Yeah, this mission here would be so easy if you had a normal squad like not even a problem. Could use uh, the sector if we could kill him. We could gain his mind shield, which would be good. We need sector corpses for the mind shields. Okay, some patrolling shenanigans here. That's fine. Roger that. 
squad located. I'm wondering why the school mining wouldn't work, to be honest. Hmm. Strange. We're overwatching for now. Let's hope that we can school mine the advent. Stun answer here. I would like to take him instead of the advent uh, captain over here. Remember, the idea is we just want to get some intel, really. And while it is already tempting, like I can feel an itching in my finger to maybe be willing to do the entire mission, I think it would be unwise. So we're preparing for the school mining. And this here is a successful school mining. Come on, facility lead. Buddy, I know you can do it. That's my boy. That is my boy. Yeah, as much as I wish to stay, like I really would like to to kill these guys. I don't see a way of how we can do it without taking major risk. Nope. Oh yeah. Well, look who's here. Don't want to fight her. She get all of these bone, uh, bony. It's crazy. It gets less and less fun to fight her every single time. At least we're not going to, or at least we're not forced to fight her this time. We're fighting against the hunter. <laughs> mission did not fail. Our personal mission succeeded. Very much so. Alright, so we got another facility lead. Which means I think we got two facility leads now. I think we do have two facility leads for now. Let's keep them. I don't want to use them. We're not eliminating the facilities. There is a maximum, by the way, of five facilities uh, that they are building. They got all five of them currently up and running. Most of them have a bleep or two. Like, we got one access to the South Africa one. It's fine. We're we're in an all right spot. Avenger spawning new cord. The chosen finally got the information they needed to find us, Commander. We should get this. <laughs> well, any indication this won't be easy. I will not waste another opportunity. This is not going to be easy. Oh, we're we're fighting the assassin. Oh, I forgot about that. Normally, normally when they are assaulting you, they will not. Well, they will not um, join the normal missions. Anyways, before we go on to this, I'll finish the episode here and uh, wrap it up. We're going to see one another in the next episode, guys. Uh, it's time to f defend our um, our 
Avenger for a second time. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate uh, the time in this campaign. We're going to defend and we're going to turn it around. I promise you we're kind of on the tipping point. I got this feeling that if, if we can just defend, we're going to be fine. Uh, but it's going to be a hard mission, so I'm looking forward for that. Thank you so much for watching, and leave a comment, and hit the like button. Thank you, and bye-bye.